All right. Uh, welcome back to Firewatch. We're sitting here at the desk on day two, and uh, we got some whiskey. We got a photo with Julia. Can't see her because she's doing the flash the, uh, radio. Give me. Okay. Um, awake, I'm awake. Awake. What's your problem? Our problem. Sorry, our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. Oh, great. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. There's no backup? The backup is the two-day hike out of here. So, that's a no? It's easier for me to send all the lookouts out to check the status of the wire in their areas. Yours is a good hike away. If you find any portion of it down, I can try to get a hold of a ranger, and he'll bring someone in to fix it. Okay, I can do that. Where is it? Remember that cave you hiked through yesterday? Yes. Yeah, of course. So, you're gonna wanna go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Will do. Uh, Thanks, Hank. It's Henry. What, you don't like Hank? Yeah, I don't like Hank. But Hank's rhymes with Hank. Mm, no, it doesn't. <laughs> okay, alright. Uh, Hank Hill. I'll tell you what, I sell propane and propane accessories. And, uh, god dang it, Bobby. Where's the sign? Am I going the wrong way? Oh. <laughs> uh, it's down by the outhouse. Which is over there. <laughs> Just starts wandering in the wrong direction. Huh. I don't think there's any fictional character I hate more than Forrest Burns. Henry, as an employee of the Forest Service, <laughs> that is treason. Yeah, well, he really freaked me out as a kid. He inspired me to spend the bulk of my 30s keeping the wilderness safe. A shrink would have a field day with you. <sighs> Thanks, Mom. What kind of name is Forrest Burns anyway? Well, that would be a pun, Hank. A glorious pun. I went to junior high with a guy named Royal Butts. Royal? Butts. <laughs> Butts. <laughs> I didn't think anyone had been named Royal since the 1850s. Well, Royal's mom, Flo, was a bit of a trendsetter. Flo <laughs> Butts? Oh, man, oh, that's my even God. worse. <laughs> yeah, well, it's still better than Forrest Burns. You know, as much as this guy loved his wife, Julia, uh, he seems to be moving on with his redding, redding, wedding ring on and seems to be talking it up with, uh, what was her name, Sheila? I don't, <laughs> I don't remember. No, that was the bartender. Who the frick is this lady? Did I forget their name? Or did they not say their name? I'm gonna call them... Barbara. Because... Why not? Ooh, it's either... We got some fog. <sighs> It's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder though, right? Yeah, they are. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what's life like? I just spend a lot of time with Julia. Oh, so you have someone there. Well... But you're taking a little break. Or... We're... <sighs> Look, I'm sorry. Can you hold that thought? Uh, sure. Just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms up. Hey, oh. I don't think so. Why, have you? What? what Okay, good. No, I don't think he has any idea. I'm absolutely sure. Would you? All right. I'll let you know if anything changes in that regard. Hey, 
Sorry about that. Anyway, uh, Julia, girlfriend? Ex? Sorry, I, I don't mean to pry. Um, yeah, that would be my wife, Julia. Oh, like, like your wife? Or like she's taken half my stuff, wife? My wife. But you're here. Everything's fine, just, you know, we're taking some time apart, getting some fresh air. A little change. Yeah. All right, well, we can just leave it at that. Thanks. Sweet. Now we're greatly acquainted with uh, Julia and, or Barbara now knows who that is. And I now know that there's something else happening. And uh, that apparently I'm not supposed to know. I see power lines. Let me eat it. I want to eat the power lines. I'm hungry. Where? What? What am I? What am I? What? Oh. Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. Okay. We're gonna run up the hill. Run up the hill. Make a right turn at the rock and go back down. Then we're gonna look at a sign. And it's gonna say that I am... A thoroughfare? That must be where Barbara's at. I don't have <laughs> um, and a bear tooth. Um. Ah. Outhouse. Uh -uh -uh. Anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello. Okay then. Well then, I'm gonna go look at it. Hello? Anybody home? Oh. It was a fire watch station. Damn it. <laughs> It's a, it's a guitar. It's got a single string. Um, cold stove. Okay. Burned the, oh, okay. The place burned to the ground. Got it. Uh, which means there must have been a fire in this area. Well, what a lovely story that this cabin told. I'm gonna go and uh, find that power line. <laughs> Hey, I found a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh, you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, but, you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. I mean, uh, I'm in the right area? I do believe. Uh, the comms I do believe. Uh, Follow it all the way to the top of Beartooth Point, and if it's not damaged, you can loop around back home. Beartooth. I'll show you my Beartooth. I don't know what that means exactly, but, um, yeah, we got, <laughs> I, I am amazing at content creation. You know, it's really just talking to yourself. I mean, no, it's not. It's talking to people. And if I wasn't talking, it would be just a gameplay video, and that's no fun. No one likes just a gameplay video, unless you want to w see what the first like couple minutes of a game looks like to see if you want to get into it or not then it's okay but uh utility pole 
So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires? What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just seems dangerous. Well, if they don't hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out, but I'd rather it not come to that. Um... Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Really? Awesome. Good find. It's like, I don't know, a mile and a half east of me. You just follow the trail up the hill, you can't miss it. I'll go see what the damage is. Yep, yep, yep. Ooh, go hell. Go hell. Ah, put it in your mouth. Yep. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. It's snipped clean through, and there's a bunch of beer cans out here. The same beer those girls were drinking. They also left us a, a message. <sighs> These idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize Go hell. how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And Ooh. then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Hmm. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? <laughs> I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm. I don't know. Um... <sighs> Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am gonna need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. Hey! I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Oh, well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe oh. they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Hey, naked women! You guys are bitches! You know that? You're a bunch of stinky doo-doo bitches. This is why you don't associate with girls who think that they're cool. You gotta associate with the girls who are cool. They don't need to think that they're cool. Because if you think you're cool, then you probably are. If you don't care what people think, then you're cool. And something about two girls stripping down naked and dancing at a lake just screams, I... I think I'm cool. Check me out. Ooh, look at me. I lost the beer cans. <laughs> Hello. God, how how many beers are these chicks drinking? Well, I hopped down a drop, and now I can't climb back up. Mm, that is a pickle. I can just keep hiking, but I figured I should let you know in case I get myself trapped out here. Well, hopefully that doesn't happen before you find these assholes. I was thinking you should probably head back to where you saw them last. Oh. Um. Yeah, I lost the beer cans. Ooh, a zip line. Uh, where the fuck am I? Oh, I'm all the way up there. Right? Yeah. Okay. Cool. That's helpful. Ah, no. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um. Hello? Does anybody know where I am? I'm kind of lost in the woods. Jonesy Lake, that's where I want to go. Yeah, Jonesy. From Fortnite. 
got the victory royale. Hey, backpack. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Gimme. Swipe. <laughs> Take mine. Anything? Ow! Jesus! Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them. In decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Was he a ranger or something? Oh, no, no. He was stationed in Two Forks, near Lookout, with his dad, Ned, three <clears throat> summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? Mm, no. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. Why? Where did they go? I don't know. I never really hit it off with old Ned. And, and um, <laughs> one day they were just gone. Sucks. Anyway, so it goes. Have uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a photodome employee. I'll try. I don't know. I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? I see a really thin plume of smoke. I see it too. A thin plume like this is either a new fire or a campfire. Campfire? Y you think it's them? <sighs> I reckon so. It looks like it's to the southwest of me. That's right. If you hike towards Five Mile Creek, that should put you in the neighborhood. Keep an eye on that smoke plume. Let me know if it's getting any larger. I'm watching that. Will do. Come here. I'm gonna take a picture of you. <laughs> That's awful. Uh, <laughs> okay. Yep. Wandering in the Just woods. Just so you know, I didn't mean to overstep my bounds earlier. Oh, wow, wow. I know you didn't. You were just making conversation. I appreciate it. So, tell me about her, if you want. She's actually very sick. I shouldn't be here. Okay. Well, in the meantime, you are here, and it's beautiful, and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, sure. Uh, uh, I'm trying to... Ha <laughs> How do I get down? Oh. I'm mentally ill. more rocks to climb uh, man this is I mean so far this is a very beautiful game quite funny at times and uh, I'm starting to en enjoy it yeah, I see you over there yeah you probably see me too you're a creep like that 
Cause I'm a creep. <laughs> I'm a weirdo. My name is Kermit the Frog. Another box. Candy. Tasty. Okay. All right. Where are you, you stupid girls? I'm gonna come and kick you. Or no, not kick you. I can't abuse them. I have to just be. Rah, I'm a bear. I'm a bear. Hey, look, it's that spot again, I think. I'm back at the shale slide. You know, the one that nearly killed me yesterday. You ready to give it another shot? Do I seriously have to? To get down to Five Mile Creek? Yeah, afraid so. It's <laughs> quite a ways downhill from here. Bling! Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> I just broke my neck. <laughs> All right. What are you? T what are they, what are they be up to over here? I'm gonna kick your ass, okay? About to crank nineties on their asses. Yeah, that's right. We're going back in time to the first Thanksgiving to get turned. <laughs> Off the menu. What does she have? She's got Alzheimer's. Like, um, dementia. Whoa. How old was she? Is she? She's alive. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you guys found out? Devastating, especially for her, you can understand. And for you. Anyway, everything she worked for was taken away, and that was it. Yeah, I'm sorry to be such a downer. Don't, don't, don't even. I'm happy to listen. Help. And, you know, we'll try to have some fun this summer. I promise. Can I go through the lake? Of course not. I went the wrong way. Oh man, this is stinky. Sorry, right. I'm getting close to my mic so I can see the map. How the fuck do I get over there? Oh wait, there's a zoom in button. <laughs> um Right, so I clearly made a wrong turn. Hey, they came back to their clothes. So they're no longer naked. Good to know. We got no more, no more potential hazardous activities on YouTube. <laughs> God, <laughs> fucking nude male drawing in the first. <laughs> Whew. That's a great way to start off a game. Clip. 
keep breaking my neck. <laughs> All right. So, how'd you meet? Met in a bar. Mm, the birthplace of modern romance. <laughs> I stumbled over and told her she was pretty, and that was it. Oh, you were brave. I was drunk. Same thing. Yeah. Hold on. Fingers need to pop. Okay. Man, I, I gotta say, these people have got to up their security. Ooh. Oh, what is that? Pine cone? Hmm, yep, that's a pine cone. Pine cone. Pine cone. Missing person. Mitch Michaels. Age 31, height 6 foot 2, weight 165, hair short and brown, identifying features distinctive facial hair. Mitch Michaels was last seen around Jonesy Lake on July 3rd, 1981. He was first reported missing on July 29th, 1981 by Forest Service personnel. He is not known to be familiar with the area. Last known location, Mitch was seen around, yep, yep, yep. Vehicle info, 1972 Ford F-250, blue and white. License plate, if you have seen, damn, okay. I wonder if that was that guy I just saw early in the previous day. I'm gonna keep it. Gimme. Uh, tab. Okay. Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? I didn't. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for hundreds of years, even through fire. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Yeah, I see the stream, but I don't see the smoke anymore. I haven't gone the right way. I am. Hehehe. <laughs> A really nice waterfall down here. Given those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Gimme. Here, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. I see a campsite, and it looks like they've got a fire. Is it them? That seems like it. I swear, they must have dragged four cases of beer out here. Track them down, and don't let them see you. What a job this is. These girls have a full case of beer left here. A full case. Well, they're impressive little shits, I guess. That is some dedication. Well, I found some dangerous hunks. What on earth are you... It's the name of a magazine for girls. It's on the ground here at their camp. I don't get why the hunks have to be so dangerous. Well, you're clearly not a young woman. Girls should want nice hunks. <laughs> Ugh, boring. Shut up, lady. I have entered the teen zone. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, really? And where's that? It's another one of those magazines. Pants. Wait, what does that say? Pants, they're back. Makeup to make out. Top hunks ranked and rated. Jesus. I'm gonna stomp it again. Yeah, take that. 
Um, uh, am I supposed to... Ah, found my sheets! So they did break into your tower. Looks like... <laughs> Just gonna leave it on the ground. Haha, -ha, tent. Your tent looks like it's been through the shredder. Which would explain that scrap I found. What could have done that? Oh, they got... Like a, like Please tell me they got... Or, um... I don't know, it sounds crazy, but even a bull elk, if it's off its... Dear Psycho, I hope you're fucking happy. We're leaving and we're going to find the police or whatever and tell them about how you creeped on us in the lake and then came and destroyed our campsite and all of our stuff. Oh, and stealing panties is gross. Ow. You're probably a mental fucking axe murderer and are so going to jail. I hope it was worth being a jerk over some fireworks. Dick. Rocker. Whatever did it, did not hold back. You've got that camera, right? It might be a good idea to get a few snaps, just in case. Yeah, good thinking. Well, they're gone, for sure. How can you tell? Oh my god. The girls left someone, me, I guess, a note. Well, what's it say? Threatening to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well, <laughs> did you? Look, I didn't do anything to them, but it looks like someone had it out for them. Then why do they think it's you? Fuck, I don't know. Huh. Hey, I don't. I believe you. Come on, Henry. All right. All right, it's just, it's weird what happened out here. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers. They could be having a bad mushroom trip. We really don't know, but they're gone. There's no way to call the cops. They're not coming back, and we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Yeah, me too. Okay, day three, let's go, we made it. Another day in the books. <laughs> All right, yep. Hey, we completed another day. Oh, I can see. Gosh. I did save. I'm gonna press it again. Yeah, all right. Um, oh, why? Subtitles would be nice. I don't know why I, I haven't played that, pressed that before. Um, yeah. Anyway. Another day in the books. Another video in the books. Hey, Henry. Shut up. I don't, no, uh, god damn it. <laughs> what do you look like? Her name's Delilah? Why are you asking? Because I'm horribly superficial. No. Who the fuck is Bert? Isn't that hard? Yeah. I could be Tom Cruise's good-looking twin brother. Oh, that's too bad. I read in people he's like five foot nothing. Yeah, well, you can't win them all. Okay, well, that gives me a good start. Now let's see. In my scope, I can only tell you're a white guy wearing shorts. It's hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. It's not very, uh, you know, PC or whatever they say. Oh my god. God, you are the whitest man. Wow. <laughs> I don't need a spotting scope for that. And if not shorts, then what do you normally like to wear? Um. Uh, clothes. clothes. I don't really think about it. Oh, come on. I got a sweatshirt I like. Good jacket I got at the Buckle Barn. Ooh, I love the Buckle Barn. Just one of those brown ones, you know? I do. Now tell me about your face. I'm looking at you across the bar. What do I see? Uh... Hmm. I know it's not easy. Well, I have a thin mustache. Real thin mustache. I got a, a long scar. Goes down across my eye and down my cheek. Well, I just happen to have a thing for thin mustaches. Oh, the great. thinner and pervier the better. I... Well, then you are in luck. And a horrible scar. <laughs> Just perfect. Am I lying? <laughs> I want to know about your eyes. Get out of here. I'm drawing you. I need to know. Your what? Is, is that okay? Uh... Don't... Don't answer. I'm gonna do it regardless. Fine. Your eyes. Tell me. 
But they look tired, I think. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you know, you hit a certain age and you just... You think you're a younger person who just... Delilah's an artist! <laughs> Speak for yourself, mister. That sounds... I guess that's getting old. Well, some people might see distinguished. Okay, got it. Thank you, Henry. You get what you need? <laughs> Absolutely. I think I just lied. <laughs> cool. Uh, now I'm gonna save. And, um... Yeah, that's another... Another, uh... Another day down. And, uh, I think we're making some good progress on whatever this is supposed to be. I don't know exactly what I'm looking for or what the, the end game of this is gonna look like. But, uh, I'm enjoying it. And, uh... We got rid of those naked bitches. So, that's good enough for me. Um, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, I guess. I don't know. B bye. <laughs> Yikes.